Hello everyone, welcome back. Today I'm going to lead you through a 20 minute full body workout using a set of dumbbells. I'm sticking to just using one set of dumbbells throughout the entirety of this workout. So this is perfect if you have limited access to equipment. Make sure you can see your screen so you can follow along with me. And without further ado, let's get to it. All right, we are taking this in pairs today. So we're gonna work in two exercises at a time. All of our exercises are 45 seconds on with a 15 second rest. First up, you're gonna come down into a sumo squat with your dumbbells in front. As you come up, dumbbells come up and we're gonna do a full press overhead without extending our elbows. We wanna keep a slight bend to protect those elbows. Here we go. So coming all the way down and up. Keep your chest lifted as you come down and keep those elbows by your sides. So you're doing a curl motion. Push through those glutes. Good, killer right off the bat. Second exercise, you're gonna do a march. So we're just marching with our lower half. Upper half is gonna be a hammer curl. You're gonna alternate. So slowing it down here a little bit, focusing on form, keeping that rib cage closed. Elbows are locked by your sides. You're bringing your knee up as high as you can. Good, take a nice little breather. We're gonna repeat that sequence again. So starting off with our sumo, two full press. Here we go, when you're coming down in your squat, make sure you're sitting back into those glutes, sit back in those heels, come up, dumbbells come up, and we press above head. When we come up, don't hinge those hips forward. Down and up. Good, enjoy this 15 second rest. Here we go, we're marching. I know this is very simple movements, but focus on moving everything as one. Exhaling as you bring everything up, squeezing that core. Nice job. <laughs> Moving on to our second superset. We're gonna do a deadlift with a front raise. So coming down for our deadlift, hinging at the hips, and we come up. Then from here, we're gonna lift the dumbbells up with palms facing forward. 
making sure that when we lift, we're not coming higher than the shoulder. We're just slightly lower with the elbow slightly bent. And as we do that front raise, we're not using any momentum to get it up. We're just lifting. Keep that chin tucked in the deadlift. Good, second exercise. Dumbbells are gonna come up by your shoulders here. You're gonna take a squat. And then this is gonna be a nice explosive movement. Everything's gonna move at the same time. We're gonna twist and the arms come up like so. So doing a single arm shoulder press, twisting, using that core, come down, other side. You're exhaling as you press up. work enjoy this 15 second rest we're going to repeat those again really focus on form with this deadlift so you're hinging at the hips take it nice and slow come up we're not hinging our hips all the way forward here we're standing firm in the ground knees stay slightly bent the whole time You can always do this with one dumbbell if lifting both for the front raise is too heavy. Good, quick rest. Doing our squat with our twist. As we twist, think about closing that rib cage, exhaling, everything's nice and tight. All the way down in that squat, here we go. All the way down. Keep this chest lifted as you come down. Few more seconds. Good, let's head down to the floor. We're gonna do some abs. So we're gonna come on our back first. We're gonna do a crunch with our legs up. Then we're gonna hold the arms there and do a leg drop. So crunch down. Drop those legs, keep the back press to the floor, crunch it up. Keep the chest open as you crunch neck long. Good, we're gonna sit up. 
You can either hold one dumbbell or both. We're just gonna do some twists. So you're gonna sit back to where those tension is on the low abs. Back is straight, we're twisting and coming back. Drop that dumbbell right down by that hip. Chest is open, back is straight. Good, repeating those two again. So coming down on your back. Keep that back pressed to the floor. Good, sitting up, getting ready to twist. Nice job. All right, next up, you're gonna use one dumbbell. Have that in the middle of a high plank. So start in this high plank position, you're gonna jump the feet in. So you're sitting in this squat position from here, lift the dumbbell for a front raise, back down, step it out, bring each knee in. Two, jump it in, lift, down, jump it out, one knee in, nice flat plank. work second exercise one dumbbell again you're gonna lean over nice flat back here we're gonna do one uh, row switch the arm other row switch so we stay in this nice flat back position the whole time here we go drive the elbow back Don't forget about your core.
good, shake it out. We're gonna repeat those again. So get that dumbbell ready. Same thing when you're doing this front raise, make sure it's not coming too high up. You wanna keep it slightly lower than your shoulder. Whew. Here we go. Use that core when you're lifting the dumbbell. Good. take a nice little breather. Getting ready for our alternating single arm rows. Nice flat back, hinge at the hips. Drive the elbow back, squeeze. One more super set to go. All right, we are gonna do a reverse lunge with a hammer curl. So grab both weights this time. And we're gonna step back to a lunge, come up, option to lift the leg for a knee drive, hammer curl. Down, if you're not lifting, you're tapping the toe, curl. Keep those elbows tucked, use that core. Don't forget about the form in the lunge. Press through the heel. Good. Next exercise. You're gonna use that same supporting leg. So if you were stepping back, and your right leg with your supporting leg. We're gonna do a side lunge and you're gonna bend into that right leg. Dumbbells in opposite hand. Lunge, side lat lift. Down, keep the chest lifted. Palm facing the floor, elbow slightly bent. And we're not lifting higher than the shoulder. Press through that heel. Nice job. We're gonna switch it around. So we're gonna switch the leg for the reverse lunge. If you were stepping back with your left, you're now stepping back with your right. Down. Use that supporting leg for balance. Press through your heel, use that core.
Good, switching sides for our side lunges. So going onto that same leg. This is our last exercise. Really think about mind to muscle. We're thinking about the supporting leg. Thinking about pressing the floor away. As we come up from here, we're pressing it away. Nice, strong core. Just moving that arm. job and that is it guys really quick but super effective full body workout in 20 minutes using one set of dumbbells i hope you enjoyed this one make sure you go do a cool down my warm-ups and cool downs are always linked in the description of every single video i have something to suit your style whatever you're in the mood for thank you so much for being here with me today if you enjoyed this one give it a thumbs up for me and if you're new here hit the subscribe button turn on your post notifications so you don't miss another video from me and I will see you guys next time. Bye. If you enjoy my workout videos, then make sure to join me in the MadFit app. You'll get access to structured programs, challenges, exclusive workouts, recipes, and many more amazing features that will help you on your health and fitness journey. If you haven't already downloaded MadFit, make sure to click the link in the description and I will see you guys inside the app.